good evening, Ana Maria. How are you? I am just fine, just fine. Good night. Good evening, good evening. Cuando es saludo es good evening. Hello, Victor. How are you? Fine, fine. Great, excellent, excellent. Hey, this Sarah. Sarah is connecting right now. Let's see, she's connecting the audio. Hello, Sarah. Hi, Hi good evening. Good evening, how are you? I'm fine, teacher, and you? I'm just great, thank you. <laughs> okay. So let's see who else is going to connect right now and just post the message to everybody. Good evening. Good evening. Hello, Otoniel. How are you? I'm fine. Okay, good, good. Hey, I like to see you guys. Me encanta verlos. If you can, please activate your camera. So let's see, there's Carol. Hello, Carol. Hello. How are you? Hi. <laughs> A lot of noise. Mucho ruido. Yes. Están viendo la cadena. <laughs> yeah, everybody's watching that. Uh, yeah. In my case, I don't like that much the news. I don't usually watch the news. Yo casi no veo noticias. No, yo tampoco, pero aquí mi papá sí. Okay. <laughs> okay. You know, you say you use a pretty nice expression. Me neither. Me neither. Oh. Yo tampoco. Me. Okay. When you say me neither, you are saying me. Yo tampoco. Okay. Yo tampoco. Okay. Yes. So let's see. Oh, there's Zuli. Hello, Zuli. How are you? Hello, teacher. I'm fine. Oh, great. Excellent. <laughs> Let's see. There's Alberto. Hello, Alberto. Good evening. Perhaps he didn't hear me. Okay, guys. Today... Sorry, teacher. Oh, okay. There's Good evening. Alberto. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine. I... Uh, uh, I eat <laughs> in this moment. So oh, you're having dinner, <laughs> right? Excellent. <laughs> okay. The important thing is that you are also in the class. That's one Correct. of the benefits of, of from the online classes that you can do that and be in the class at the same time. Okay, let's see. Today, guys, let me t tell you a little bit that today is going to be a, a slightly different class. Ahora va a ser una clase un poquito diferente because we are going to spend more of the class, well, you are going to spend more of the class speaking, okay? We are going to put in practice, we are going to put into practice everything we have been working with about the be going to. But today we are going to apply it more into conversations, okay? We are going to talk first, uh, we are going to talk about uh, Christmas, we are going to talk about birthday, I'm going to assign you a homework for tomorrow. Voy a dejar una tareita para mañana. Simple. Don't worry. Very simple. And tiny. Simple y chiquita. Okay? So don't worry because I saw some people getting like, mm, no homeworks. Don't worry. It's going to be very simple. Let's see. Let's start. I'm sorry, Ana Maria. You are the first in my screen. Perhaps because of your name. Creo que por el nombre me aparece la primera. Yes. Hello, Ana Maria. How are you? Hello. I'm good. And you? I'm just fine. Tell me, Ana Maria, uh, do you celebrate Halloween? No, I don't. And what about, do you celebrate Christmas? Yes. Okay. Tell me, Ana Maria. What are you going to do for Christmas? Uh, I'm going to 
go to my mother's house okay. and have dinner with all the family. Excellent. Okay, what do you prepare for dinner? Uh, usually we eat turkey. Okay, you like turkey? Turkey. Turkey, yes, I like. Okay. Well, interesting. Okay, guys. So, you see what we did just just now? ¿Se fijaron lo que hicimos ahorita? I just asked her, how are you going to celebrate Christmas? And she answered. Now, I'm going to divide you in pairs. You are going to tell each other how you are going to celebrate Christmas. And then we are going to come back and you are going to tell me about the other person. Okay? Do you understand the activity? Los divido en parejas. Le preguntan a la otra persona. You listen, pay attention, and when we come back, ustedes me dicen lo que your classmate is going to do. Okay? So, ready? Perfect. Let me create the groups right now. And they are created, guys. Please, join in. Unámonos. going to do Christmas? For Christmas. For Christmas? Yes. What are I, you going? I am going to. Ella le pregunta qué va a ser for Christmas. And you answer, I am going to. Pork leg, I don't know. Pork, pork leg. <laughs> Teacher, how do you say pierna de cerdo? Oh. Pork leg, no. <laughs> yes. Pork. 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 So, yes. Pig is the animal when it is alive. Pig is ah. the animal is alive. Decimos pig cuando el animal está vivo. But when it is dead, we say pork. Ah, it's pork. It's like it's like you have a cow or you have bulls. You have a or tiene toro or oxen, que es buey. But when it is dead, the meat, la carne, cuando ya está muerto, is beef. It's beef. Yeah, you know, siempre hemos comido beef steak. That's beef steak. It's the name in English. El nombre en inglés, beef steak. Ah, buen dato. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let me see, let me see. Tamara is not assigned to any group. We are going to assign her. <laughs> okay, let me see. Somebody is telling me that they don't hear a classmate. And let's see. Okay, bye, guys, we're going back. Hi, teacher. Okay, okay. You back. Yeah, usted me escucha bien. Yes, I can hear you ah. perfectly. Ah, okay, okay. No, listen. Oh, you couldn't listen. My partner. To... Who was your partner? ¿Quién era su eh, Roberto Antonio. Creo. Y luego, y, y luego eh, se agregó a Tamara. Okay. Oh, yeah. There's Tamara. I'm sorry, Tamara, but the time was short. So we came back here. Ah, okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Let's see. Well, tell me, Ana Maria, who were you working with? 
I'm working with Roberto Suarez. With Roberto Suarez. Okay, tell me, how is Roberto going to celebrate Christmas? Uh, he's going to cook uh, a pork leg. Okay, pork leg. Pork leg. Great. Pierna de cerdo, pork leg. Wow, that's a big piece of the animal. That means that he likes. You know, I love pork ribs. Oh, yes. I like pork ribs, but the ones like this, delicious. Okay. Thank you, Ana Maria. And tell me, Roberto, how is Ana Maria going to celebrate Christmas? Ah, uh, you don't remember? We don't have, no, we don't have time to. We didn't. We didn't. We, we didn't have time to. Okay, no problem, no problem. Talk about it. Actually, you already said it, no? Realmente ya lo había dicho ella. Okay, thank you. Let's see, Carol. Hello, Carol. Hello. Who were you working with? Uh, Flora. Argentina. Okay, tell me about Flora. Um, Flora, uh, uh, I'm going to dinner uh, house family. Is going to have dinner. Uh, go, what? Is going to have dinner. Is going to have dinner. Uh, for, uh, cerdo? Oh, pig. Pig, yes. Okay, she's going to prepare pig for dinner. She's going to prepare pig. Big pig dinner. Well, actually, actually, pork. I'm sorry, pork. Pork. Yeah, mm -hmm. I was explaining to some of your classmates. When the animal is alive, cuando el animal está vivo, pig. When they, okay. when you talk about the meat, pork. Pork. Okay. Yeah. The same goes with the cow. Lo mismo es con la, what we call uh, la vaca or the... El pez. We say beef. Okay. Like uh, I was telling a, a group that what we call here in Spanish bistec, it's beef steak. Be oh, okay. The name beef. actually is belongs to the English because you are talking about beef steak. That's the name of the dish, beef steak. Thank you very much. Let's see, um, nom, 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 nom. Joel, tell me, Joel, who were you working with? Hi, my name is Joel. Disculpe que, que entré tarde porque estaba en la reunión ahí con el presidente y no me dejaba salir. Okay, que tenía no, problem. no problem, no problem. Tell me, who were you working with? ¿Con quién trabajó? In yesterday? No, oh, you were not in the practice. Don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. Let's jump to Tamara. Tamara, hello. Hello. Tell me, Tamara, how do you celebrate Christmas? Um, I'm beef. Um, lasagna. Oh, you prepared lasagna for Christmas? Yeah. Yes. Interesting. And who do you celebrate it with? Con quien la celebra? Um, with my family, father, okay. mother. Okay. Where are you going to celebrate it? Donde? In my house. Okay. Remember, you can say at home. Recordemos que podemos decir at home. If you say at home, you mean mi hogar. Okay. okay. You are being more specific than if you say in my house. When you say in my house, you refer just to the physical space. But when you say at home, you are talking something more personal. Okay? Okay. Okay. Thank you. No, to you. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Suli. Hello, Suli. Hello, teacher. Tell me, Suli, how are you going to celebrate Christmas? I'm going to this um, pan with panes, no sé cómo se dice. Stuff? 
rellenos? Relleno, rellena de pollo, no sé. Ok, chicken. Stuff. Stuff. With. Chicken. Uh, uh, beef steak. Ok, great, thank you. Now let's see Urania. Hello Urania. Hi teacher. Tell me Urania, how are you going to celebrate Christmas? Mm. In Christmas I'm going I'm going to cook um, chicken. I I'm going to cook um, cupcakes. Okay. Uh, solo. Oh, so you like baking? Le gusta baking. Baking, hornear. All right. You like baking? Mm. Interesting. Because she's going to prepare cupcakes. Yeah. Okay, great. Excellent. Excellent. Alberto Raimundo. Hello, mister. Hello, teacher. How are you going to celebrate Christmas, Alberto? Uh, usually, uh, I'm going to celebrate uh, Christmas uh, with with my family at home. Okay. Uh, I I pre I prepare uh, uh, maybe turkey turkey. Okay. Uh, excellent. Uh, and. Uh, and maybe maybe uh, dance dance with my wife or oh cool <laughs> my wife and uh, our our daughters or kids daughter. okay. daughters perfect yeah not a not a lot of men like to dance no muchos hombres les gusta bailar it's good that you like it <laughs> yeah I know that these ladies can tell me that some husbands they don't like dancing. Estas chicas me pueden decir que algunos esposos no les gusta bailar. Okay, now let's see. As you can see, there's just one little detail that I'm going to make clear for everybody. When you say usually, desde el momento que decimos usually, automatically the rest of the sentence is simple present. Okay? Cuando utilizamos la palabra usually, I usually automáticamente el resto de la de lo que usted va a decir va en presente simple. Why? Because usually it's an adverb of frequency. Usually es un adverbio de frecuencia. And when you express the frequency, when you do something, cuando usted expresa la frecuencia o la regularidad con la que hace algo, you are talking about habits. Estamos hablando acerca de hábitos. And those are expressed in simple present. Y eso se expresan en presente simple. So you say, oh, I usually prepare do this and I usually dance with my wife and my kids. You are saying the habit or the routine. Está diciendo el hábito o la rutina. Ok. Excellent, excellent. Now, I'm going to project to you four different questions. Le voy a presentar cuatro preguntas. With those questions, I'm going to present them to you in 30 seconds. You are going to copy them down if you want or take the screenshot. And then I'm going to divide you in pairs. You are going to ask that question to your classmates. And when we come back here, you are going to tell me about the other person, okay? Ready? I'm going to show them to you right now. Let's see. Where is it right here? And we're talking about this and okay. We are talking about your birthday, guys. So everybody's going to talk to me about birthdays. The first question, how are you going to celebrate it? How, como? Where are you gonna celebrate it? Donde? Who are you going to invite? Quien? What type of food? ¿Qué tipo de comida are you going to prepare? I repeat, how are you going to celebrate your birthday? Where are you going to celebrate it? Who are you going to invite? What type of food 
are you going to prepare? One more time, I repeat. How are you going to celebrate it? Where are you going to celebrate it? Who are you going to invite? What type of food are you going to prepare? Now, the last question, la última pregunta, if you invite people to a restaurant, doesn't apply. Si invitamos a las personas a un restaurante, no aplica la última, okay? So, let's see. You ready, guys? ¿Listos? Yes? Perfect. Yes, ready. I'm going to divide you, to send you to the groups right now. Let's see, I got two persons without a signing. Who are they? Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. Joel, I sent you an invitation. Le envié la invitación para que entrara a grupo. Robert, also you got an invitation. How are you going to celebrate it? Ah, uh, I'm going, I'm going to celebrate. I'm going to celebrate my birthday in at home. Okay. In in see in my mother's in my mother's uh, house. You can just say at my mom's. Puedes simplemente decir at my mom's or at my mother's. At my mom's. Ajá, porque ahí no aplicaba at eh, her home porque no sabemos, o sea, no le, no le podía, no podía ya saber que era mi madre. ¿verdad? No, no, no. O sea, la, thing... la, cuando lo ocupamos como home es cuando es en nuestra casa. No, the thing is this. You can say at my mom's home, but you can say at my mom's cuando... Si ve en el chat, le acabo de poner la frase, at my mom's. When you say like that, you refer uh, automatically the other person understands that you are talking about the house. Like, you know what? Uh, Ana Maria invited me and my wife to her house. That means that I am invited to Ana Maria's for dinner. No digo okay. la palabra house. Yo digo, I am invited to Ana Maria's for dinner automatically the people who speaks English understand that you are talking about her house. Or okay. Ana, Maria, Ana Maria tells her husband, hey, ella le dice al esposo, hey, you know what? We are invited at Roberto's tomorrow for dinner. So her husband understand that they are invited to your house for dinner. Okay? Okay. Perfect. Okay, I'll be um, back soon. Okay, uh, Ana Maria. Sorry. Uncle. 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 What type of food? Uh, what type of food are you going to prepare? I'm not cooking. Not cooking. Right. No cooking. No cooking. Why not? No. Is it in the no. restaurant? In the restaurant, like? yes. Okay, which restaurant? Uh, okay. Okay. Which restaurant? ¿Cuál restaurante? Um, Koi Sushi. Okay, Sushi. Mm, sushi. Delicious. Bye. Bye. Ahora, now yes. you and me. Yes. Uh, Suli, how are you going?
Uh, where are you going to celebrate it? In my house. In my house. Uh, okay. Yes. I am going to celebrate it in my house. I am going to celebrate in my house until midnight. Ooh. Big part. Before, yes. Okay. Okay. Um, who are you going to invite? Gentlemen. Um, um, soda and uh, cake, pastel, cake, Kate. Okay, pues only <laughs> Kate. Kate. Uh -huh. Where Where are you going to celebrate Kate. your birthday, Carol? Eh, uh, uh, in at home. Okay, where do you live? So I can go. <laughs> Le falta mucho. No, no falta. Falta como tres meses. <laughs> okay, it's close. So we are in, uh, let's see, September, October. In December? You are from December? Ah, pues no, cuatro. Enero. January. 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 Okay. okay, continue, continue, ladies. Um, ahora es Flora. Who, who are you going to invite, Wendy? Um, I'm going to invite uh, my two best friends. Best okay. friends? Sí. Yeah, the teacher. Best <laughs> <laughs> Best friend no se va a ganar todavía, teacher. Oh, man. And your, and your family. In my family, yes. Okay. And you, Joel, who are you going to invite? Uh, only my friends. Only your friends? Yes. Only your friends. Um, what, what type of food are you going to celebrate, Wendy? What type of food are you going what? to eat? Como, como, what type of, of food, food are you going food? to eat? Are you going to the eat? The eat celebrate. What type? Or what, are you going type? to prepare? Okay, eat the same. Yeah. Okay. Uh, uh, I'm going to prepare Maybe sushi or Chinese. Oh, no, no. Or, or, level, or, or another, level. Another level. Another level. Yeah, yeah. And the other option is a big mariscal. Uh, big mariscal. With cream, with cream. Okay, okay. I mean, come with me. <laughs> okay, guys. And you... One, one minute, one minute. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, the food preparing, my favorite is uh, China, Chinese. Chinese. Food, Chinese. Chinese. Okay, let's see, everybody's coming back. Hello. Let's see, let's see how much, who's coming back? Who's coming back? Who's coming back? In 20, 20 seconds, there's Joel, Sarah, and Wendy are still in the group, the vital. Let's see, who am I going to start? Con quien comienzo? Oh, the first person I got in my screen, la primera que tengo en mi pantalla. Don't worry, Ana Maria, it's not you right now. Okay, thanks, Dad. Uh -huh. yeah, somebody is right now first in my screen. Alguien le quitó el puesto. La otra yeah. se pone Maria, dice solo. Yeah, next time she's not going to say Ana. No, but don't worry. <laughs> I don't know how it works. No sé cómo funciona, but right now the first one in my screen is Urania. 
the same okay. day. So, Urania, hello. Hi, hi, hello. Okay, talk to me about one of your classmates. Dígame acerca de uno de sus compañeros. I work with Romeo. Romeo, y, okay. Y Robert. Okay, tell me about Romeo. Um, Tuvo problemas de, de conexión. <laughs> uh, he say, he say, um, he is going to celebrate his his birthday with his family. Okay. Um, and what? Solo esa me pudo contestar. Okay. Solo esa me pudo contestar. Okay, then talk to me about Robert. Robert, um, he's going to celebrate um, his birthday with his family and, and, and at home. Okay, perfect. And he, he's, he's going to celebrate at home can he he going to visit his mom okay great excellent he's and, going to share with his mom and he's going to invite his friend his best friend and his father good excellent and He's yes. going to cook pork or lasagna. Pork or lasagna. Pork or lasagna. Interesting options. Thank you very much, Urania. Now, Ana okay. Maria, it's your turn. Okay. Uh, I'm worked with Roberto. Okay, tell me. Uh, He's going to celebrate his birthday in Caliches. Ooh, at Caliches. At Caliches. Caliches San Benito. Ooh. Uh, right. <laughs> uh, he's going to invite his family and his friends. Uh, so he's going to eat seafood. Yes, he's going to eat seafood. Uh, uh, be careful with we the We don't face. know how, we don't know how to say cocktail de conchas. Shell Shell, cocktail. Shells cocktail, cocktail. Okay. okay, great. He's going to eat shells cocktail. Okay, what about for drinking? What is he going to drink? I don't know, but I think he's going to drink a beer, maybe. <laughs> Perhaps. Stella. Una Stella. Oh, a beer. Una Stella. Stella Artois. Exactly. Okay. <laughs> Interesting. That's a hard drink. Remember, when you, drink. when you talk about that, remember, guys, that you can say, you can either drink uh, soft drinks Soft drinks are soda, juice, natural juice. And when you talk about hard drinks, you are talking about beers, uh, rum, uh, whiskey, tequila, or vodka. Those are hard drinks. Hard drinks. Okay, thank you very much, Ana Maria. Perfect. That's excellent. Yeah. Oh, that's a hard drink. Let's see, Roberto, please talk to me. Roberto Suarez. Okay. Um, I'm I'm work with Ana Maria, and she celebrate. He she's, she's going to celebrate. She's going to celebrate. Uh, birthday 
birthday. Her birthday. Uh, her birthday uh, with a uh, dinner. Okay. At and home or in a restaurant? She she celebrate with with her mom. Okay. At her mom's. At her mom's. Okay, excellent. And and she she invited uh, uh, her family. Okay. And uh, and friends. Okay. What type of food and is she going to eat? And she prepared uh, hamburgers. Okay, great. Um, salad. Okay, cool. Hamburgers yes. and a salad. Mm -hmm. A good equilibrium. Okay, yes. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Thank you very much, Roberto. Tamara, hello. Hi, teacher. Talk to me, Tamara. Um, on Suli. Okay, tell me about Suli. Uh, she going to celebrate um, her dinner. Dinner? With, dinner with family okay, and friends. Great. Excellent. And she restaurant Zocalo. Oh. I like, I like in, uh, Mexican food. Okay, she likes she uh, likes Chile. Mexican food. food. Okay. Thank you very much, Tamara. Okay, let's see. Now, Carol. Hello, Carol. Hello. Tell me, uh, Carol. Uh, 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 Flora, Argentina. Okay, tell me about Flora. Yes. Um, uh, he, uh, her, uh, celebrate birthday and, and with uh, family. Okay, with her family. With her family and uh, prepare a um, uh, uh, lunch. Okay. You disactivated your microphone. Okay. Uh, okay. Um, uh, eat, eat the, eating, the command, eating. Okay. And um, Kate and um, and uh, her mother prepared a soup. Uh, sopa de res. Okay, beef soup. Uh, beef soup. Beef soup and sandwich. Okay, beef soup and sandwich. And sandwich, okay. Excellent. Uh, okay, and invited and only family. Okay, just her family okay. is invited. Oh man, and I wanted to go. Yo quería ir, but she just fired. it's an exclusive celebration. Yes. <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay. Okay. Romeo. Hello, Romeo. Hello, Romeo. Mm, perhaps he's having problems with the connection. Wendy. Hello, Wendy. Hello, teacher. Oh, there's Hello, Romeo. Teacher. I'm sorry, okay. Wendy. There's Romeo. Tell me, Romeo. Hello. Hello. Who did you work with? Oh, yes, I can hear. Don't worry, don't worry. You can just listen. No se preocupe, puede solamente escuchar, okay? No problem. Wendy, tell me, Wendy, who did you work with? Uh, I work with uh, Joel and Sara. Okay, tell me about Joel, please. Uh, Joel, he's... Uh, going to celebrate his birthday with uh, with your friends. With uh, 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 listen with uh, his with his friends. friends. Perfect. With his friends. Um. And 
en the in the other times celebrate with your mom and grandpa and you and his mom okay and his grandfather perfect um no le pregunté no terminé de preguntarle qué comida okay, okay. I'm sorry Perfect, no problem, no problem. We will get to him and we will ask him. Ya vamos a llegar con él y le preguntamos. Thank you very much, okay. Wendy. Let's okay. see now. Flora, hello, Flora. Hello. Tell me. I will work on, with, with Carol. Okay, tell me about Carol. She's going to celebrate She's going to celebrate with her family. Okay, excellent. Uh, she's going to prepare prepare uh, dinner. Okay. What is she going to prepare? What type of food? ¿Qué va a preparar? Hola. <coughs> what is she going to <laughs> Uh, she's going to invite uh, her family, her fa her parents. Okay, great. Um, she's going to celebrate your birthday. Her birthday. Her birthday at home. Okay. Uh, she's going to her 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 birthday at home. Um, she's going to prepare a pan, no sé cómo dijo pan, with, with chicken. Okay, bread. Bread stuff with chicken. Great, excellent. Thank you very much, Flora. With bread stuff. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Let's see. Well, let me see. Yeah, we still have time for one. I'm sorry for the rest. Lo siento por los demás porque ya solo me queda tiempo para uno because then I, we have to jump to another activity. So let's see who's going to be the, the lucky one. Veamos quién va a ser el afortunado. Victor Ayala. Hello, Victor. Hello, teacher. Okay, tell me, who do you work with? Uh, I work uh, with Otoniel. Okay, tell me about Otoniel, please. Uh, he celebrated Christmas okay. with uh, his family and girlfriend okay. at home um, uh, and preparing food uh, chicken okay. uh, porneado al horno. Oh, rose. Rose. Yes, Rose. Okay. Thank you. Roast. Let's see. Let's roast see. chicken. Okay. Teacher? Yes, roast chicken. Roast chicken. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Sarah. Sarah, tell me. I still got time. Todavía tengo tiempo. Sarah, tell me. Hi, teacher. Hello. Um, uh, Tell me the, about how uh, you work with Sully, I guess. And uh, no, it's Wendy. Wendy, Wendy I work Wendy. Wendy with with Wendy. Um, Wendy, she's going to celebrate your birthday with your his birth his birthday her birthday her birthday her birthday yeah. her birthday. You, you will get with... me in trouble. La meter en problema. Yeah. <laughs> her birthday with your with her, uh, is it, uh, her, fr her friends igual verdad okay yes her friends um, and family um, we're we're going to celebrate at home okay she's going to His, her so, at home uh with his best friend. Her. Is, she's she, her best friend. Her going to prepare um big mariscada. 
on and sushi. Great, excellent. Very well, thank you. Okay, let's see, Javier Mauricio. Hi, teacher. Hello, tell me, who were you working with? I, I'm working with Victor. Okay, tell me about Victor. He's going to celebrate Christmas and he's going to celebrate in your house. Uh, 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 in his house. In his house. Yes. And he's going to celebrate uh, with your fa family. His family. His family. And he's going to prepare a chicken. Okay, good. Only. Okay, perfect. Okay, guys, look, I'm going to make a pause here, voy a hacer una pausa acá, because I want to explain something that I have seen that gives a little bit of trouble. Hay algo que hemos detectado que le da un poquito de lío. And it's understandable, es entendible. The problem is that uh, we get confused with the use of the Spanish. Nos confundimos con el uso del español when we talk about the possessive because it's understandable, it's entendible. In Spanish, we use the word su for everything, para todo. We talk, we say su for for you. Utilizamos su para usted y para ustedes. Like, uh, this is your house, esta es su casa. This is your class, guys. Esta es su clase, from all of you, su. This is, uh, I like Roberto's curtain. Me gusta la cortina de Roberto. I like his curtain. Me gusta su cortina. Again, the same word. Man, I love Sully's glasses. I love her glasses. Me gustan sus lentes. Nuevamente el su. Estoy hablando... When I was talking about Roberto, I was talking about him. Cuando hablaba de Roberto, hablaba de él. Cuando hablo de Zuli, hablo de ella. Cuando hablé de, dije su clase, hablaba de ustedes. But in Spanish, we use the same word for everything. Okay? And let me show you something. Okay, we have it here. Let's see. The problem is this that for I, it's simple because for I, we say my. For you, we use your. For he, we use his. For she, we use her. When we talk about an object, an animal, or a situation, perhaps, we use it. When we talk about the group, like we, we say our. When we talk about some other persons, cuando hablamos de ellos, we say their. But the problem, as I told you, is Spanish. Why? Because in Spanish, this can be to or it could be su. In Spanish, this is su. In Spanish, this is again su. <laughs> and in Spanish, this is su. <laughs> this is the only one that is different, that is our, we say and when we say there, in Spanish, again, we say so. So that's the <laughs> problem. But what we must remember is that English is more specific, okay? In English, we are more specific. And you ask me, why in Spanish is different? Oh, because in Spanish, we make the difference not in that word, but in the verb. In 
español el posesivo lo agregamos, eh, a veces lo modificamos solamente con el sujeto o a veces modificamos los verbos. But in English, you have the specific possessive. So remember always to say his when you are referring to a guy, her when you refer to a lady, si nos referimos a una chica, una señora, her, our, their, your, okay? So always, always try to make that difference, okay? Siempre tratemos de hacer esa diferencia. And it's very important because, I mean, somebody can get me in trouble here. Alguien ya me estaba metiendo en problemas. Tell, saying that they were going to celebrate in my house. And I was like, uh-oh. -oh. <laughs> you see, you have to be careful because those little details change the whole idea of the sentence. Esos pequeños detalles nos pueden cambiar la idea de la oración. That's why we must be, we have to be careful. Es por eso que tenemos que ser cuidadosos. ¿Ok? Now, is that point clear? ¿Estamos claros? Yes? Yes, teacher. Yes. Perfect. Yes. Excellent. Yes. Excellent. Well, now, let's see. Let me just remind something. Recordemos algo. Eh, how are you guys working on the platform? ¿Estamos trabajando en la plataforma? Yes? Okay, remember that after each video in the platform, después de cada video en la plataforma, at the end of the video, you have an assignation. Tienen una pequeña asignación. And that assignation, you do it in the post under the video. Ustedes esa asignación la contestan así, agregando su comentario en el post abajo del video. Besides that, you have the section that is the knowledge check. Aparte de ello, tienen una sección que dice Knowledge Check, donde les aparecen ejercicios, you have multiple choice, or perhaps you have to type something, mm -hmm. or you choose true or false, dependiendo del ejercicio. For this week, I assign you, para esta semana les pedí, the exercises, uh, let me be specific, para no confundirme, 1.4, 1.11, and 1.16. Right? So, try to do them. Tratemos de hacerlos. It's very important for you to pass the course to get a good grade on the exercise. If there exists any question, si hay alguna pregunta related to the exercises, you can ask me and I can help you, okay? Ustedes me pueden preguntar. I have the, the, I have access in the computer and I also have the access in my cell phone so I can be checking fast. Yo puedo revisar rápido and help you out. No problem. Okay? Right. Now, besides that, for tomorrow, homework. An extra homework for tomorrow. Simple, short. Very simple and very short. Una tarea muy simple y muy corta. I need you to please try to remember the parts of the body. Las partes del cuerpo. Because we are going to use, tomorrow we are going to make a small review. Vamos a hacer un repasito corto and fast about the parts of the body. Because we are going to use it for another class. Porque lo vamos a utilizar para otra clase. So you remember like hair, forehead, head, uh, nose, mouth, okay? Eyebrows, eyelashes, uh, tongue, neck, shoulders, okay? Remember of the shampoo, head and shoulders. <laughs> okay? So, please, try to bring that, that idea to make a review. Write them down if you can. So, tomorrow we are going to work with the pronunciation. Así mañana trabajamos con la pronunciation. Also, if you watch the video in the platform, you can check out. Let me see. I will tell you specifically which section is it's two point let me see let me see it is loading it is loading yet okay 2.1 in 2.1 you have the parts of the body okay okay so for tomorrow i need you to please make a review of that para mañana necesito que hagamos un repaso de eso okay 
Now we are going to do the last exercise of the class. Vamos a hacer el último ejercicio de la clase. Time flies, el tiempo vuela. We just have a few minutes. But we are going to take advantage of them. Let's see. Carol, tell me, Carol, what are you going to do tomorrow? What? <laughs> what you going to do tomorrow? Um, I'm going to at work, uh, at work. Okay. I'm going to go to work. I'm going to work to work. I'm going to go to work. Okay. Okay. Perfect. Thank you very much. And let's see. Suli, tell me, what are you going to eat tomorrow for breakfast? Breakfast. Mm. And work. I am. I am going to work. In, in, in homework. No. What are you going to eat? Tomorrow for breakfast. Breakfast, desayuno. I don't. I not breakfast. You don't have breakfast. Sometimes. Oh. Pupusas. Oh. <laughs> That's terrible. I am so sorry for it. It's you. Friday. <laughs> okay. Sometimes, sometimes tamales. <laughs> oh, come on. Maybe, maybe, Tamale. Uh, maybe, maybe. <laughs> You're killing uh, well, me here. Eggs, eggs, eggs. Eggs, eggs. Okay, <laughs> that's acceptable. I, I don't like to Egg, beans. <laughs> With milk. But. Okay, cool. <laughs> Excellent. Thank you very much, Suli. Let's see, Joel. Hello, Joel. Hi. Tell me, Joel. Uh, what are you going to eat tomorrow for lunch? Um, usually, I eat um, chicken, uh, chicken with rice. Okay, with rice. rice. With rice, yes. Excellent. I, Thank you. I I drink the water or. Uh, uh, juice, juice natural. Natural juice. Natural, natural juice. Eso quería decir. Okay, excellent. Please be careful with what he did. It's excellent, Joel. Excellent, Joel. But remember this. He said, I usually. Desde el momento que él dijo, I usually, you don't use be going to. Mm. You have to use simple present. And it's okay. Y está bien, because... He is not sure. He says the, what the routine is. Él dijo lo que es más rutinario, lo que es más común. That's why he used simple present. Cuando usamos usually, always, sometimes, those are adverbs of frequency. Esos son adverbios de frecuencia. The adverbs of frequency express the frequency when something is done. Expresa la frecuencia con la que se hace algo. So when you talk about the frequency, you are talking about routine. Cuando uh -huh. la frecuencia hablamos de una rutina. And that's simple present. Y las rutinas se expresan en presente simple. Remember, each tense expresses an idea. Ok. So let's see, let's see, let's see, Mr. Robert. Lo dije bien, teacher. Yes, perfect. The question was, what are you going to eat for lunch? Yo le pregunté qué va a almorzar. But he's not sure. Él no está seguro. So it is okay if he answered. I usually eat, está bien si él me dice, oh, normalmente como esto. He's not sure about tomorrow. No está seguro. Perhaps they have something different at the restaurant. Quizás tengan algo diferente al restaurante. Mm -hmm. So, it's okay. okay. It was perfect. Okay, thanks, thanks. You're welcome. So, tell me, Roberto Suarez. Hello, mister. Hi, teacher. Tell me. What are you going to do Saturday afternoon? Saturday afternoon. Um, I'm going to, I'm going to do, I'm going, I'm going to do? I am to, going to? 
I'm going to um, pinch Benito with my with my oh, friends. Okay, I'm going to go. I'm going to go. Oh, okay. I'm going to go to pinches uh, San Benito with my friends. Okay, good, nice. Yes. It's great, excelente. <laughs> yeah. I wonder what it feels like. Yo me pregunto qué se sentirá eso de salir con los amigos. <laughs> yeah, because hay que establecer I, cláusulas. Uh, I, have to do. I am not allowed. Tiene un permiso. Yeah. Hay that's que, that's hay que the problem. That's the problem. I didn't read the contract. You know. Eso es solo firmó. Yeah, that's the problem. Okay, okay. Let's see. Thank you. Hay que hacer mucho oficio en la casa. Oh, come on. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Flora. Hello, Flora. Hello. Tell me, Flora, what are you going to do Sunday morning? I'm going to go to uh, church. Oh, nice. Excellent. And what with about... My, with my family. What about in the afternoon? What are you going to do for Sunday afternoon? El the afternoon, yes. Afternoon, I going to see a watch movie. To watch a movie. Movies. Oh, great! Excellent. Thank you very much, Flora. So, as you can see, today we change a little bit the rhythm of the class. Si se dieron cuenta, ese día cambió un poquito el ritmo de la clase. Because you were speaking more. Okay? And that's the main idea of the class, that you apply the English you know and you add a little bit from the classes we are receiving. La idea es que ustedes apliquen un poquito más y le agreguen de las clases que vamos teniendo. So, remember, it's very important as, I mean, as much as you can, connect to the class, Eh, en la medida que podamos, conectémonos a la clase. I am connecting myself around two minutes before we start. Normalmente me conecto dos o tres minutos antes de que comencemos. So if you are connected, if you are connected at the time I get in, we start talking. We start having conversation. And mostly it's going to be like this, having conversation. Más this is true. Así. This is true, teacher. Thanks. Más que todo se maneja así having conversation because that's what I want you to do, to speak, okay? And don't worry if you make a mistake. Y no se preocupen si cometen un error. That's why we are here. Para eso estamos acá. So we can learn and fix. Thank you very much. See you tomorrow. Try to be on time. Take care. Have a good night. Good night. Good night, everybody. Good night, everybody. Good night, teacher. Good night. Good night, good night.